Yes, I am aware that The Undertaker is going to the Hall of Fame. Obviously, I've gotten a lot of messages about it. Uh, very busy, uh, so I can't really do too much but to say that I am surprised that, that he's going in this year. I thought they would hold this off and sort of save this for a few years from now. Um, but, you know, desperate times call for desperate measures. But also, it's good to just get the guy in, you know, before something you never know. You know I mean? Get the guy in the Hall of Fame. You know, I, I assume we're going to have Mark Calloway, The Undertaker, living a healthy life for the next, you know, 20. 20, 30 years, um, hopefully, at least. And um, But, yay, let's do it. There's no better time than now. I mean, that could be said for a million people who should be in the Hall of Fame that aren't in the Hall of Fame. So, uh, you know, congratulations, and this is going to be cool, man. It's going to be a special Hall of Fame. Thank goodness it didn't happen during the COVID when nobody was here. I'm still upset about that last year's class. I almost wish they would redo the, the class so they could be in front of people. Uh, this explains maybe why we haven't had any Hall of Fame announcements yet. This is the first one, and it's the biggest one. Um, uh, maybe he'll be the only one, you know, the, the, <laughs> inducted. Um, but, yeah, you know, we'd been wondering when this, if there was going to be a Hall of Fame this year, we almost thought maybe there wouldn't be. So, you know, we'll see what happens. And uh, maybe maybe he'll be the only one. Maybe he'll just be the Undertaker, and they'll bring out all the classic guys from the Attitude Era. I don't know. I, I fully expect all those guys to be at WrestleMania this year. It seems like they're pulling out all the stops for that. I mean, maybe not, but, you know, we'll see what happens. We'll see how, how much, how right we were. But either way, uh, tonight is Monetize This, and Mikel uh, is going to put the Monetize This championship on the line. And uh, so I hope to see you there. A lot of people think Tex is going to win the title tonight, uh, but people voted for me to win. So let's be honest, man. We need to get the We need to bring the belt home. To Cronin, so I can cut promos, so I can merge the old monetize this championship with the new one, and that's what I will do. So tonight I'll monetize this. Bring it on, man! Right after SmackDown and AEW Rampage, tonight is going to be hopefully wild. You know what I mean? Uh, nothing to do tomorrow, so tonight's going to be crazy. I'll see you tonight for that. Leave your comments down below. What do you think about the Undertaker going into the uh, WWE Hall of Fame? It's obviously well, 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 well deserved. I mean, you say Hall of Fame, he is Hall of Fame. Um, 2022 Hall of Fame. WWE also confirmed that for the first time ever, WrestleMania Go Home edition of SmackDown and the Hall of Fame ceremony will air live on the same night. So apparently after the Go Home show, then um, the Hall of Fame will take place. This will give fans in attendance an unprecedented opportunity to witness both events for the price of one. So after SmackDown is over, you're going to be able to then witness the the Hall of Fame. That's that's different this year. That's 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 very different. So that's interesting. Let me know what you think about all this in the comments down below, everybody. I will see you tonight for Monetize This. And here's some other videos popping up that you might have missed. Anybody who drops a super thanks, I will pin your comment to the top of this video.